I let Bez name my horse. West Ham edition, baby. Family vlog. Let's get it, baby. Big Sunday events. I love it. We got some food. We chilling today. Let's go ahead and hang out. I love you guys so much. Make sure you go support the queen as well. Big Daddy O, pull up on me, King. Yes. Guys, something is at my house. Um, I think we all know what it is. Let's be honest. Um, another horse shock, but it is here. Ollie is here, and do you know Wait, what? Wait, so did I ask another one? Well. There are so many vans here, so I don't even know. Wait, we'll so there's get three now. An issue. He's tucked down a corner. Bless him. Ollie, what you got for me? Another one. Again. Wait, four. Again. We're so used to this like van now. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh wow, hey mate. Lovely, isn't it? Go on, I've got a stable this way. Looks lovely, doesn't it? Little Barbie pony. But one stable left next to Cully. That's it. What? Nah. Oh, there's goddamn food in the way. So she probably spent it somewhere around like I would probably say like forty five to seventy five hundred dollars a horse. That's crazy. Oh my god. Mm, 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 mm. See, yeah, she's met her daddy. Yeah, you're not Pablo. Ethan's trying to name him Pablo. So his name is Spargo, which is absolutely awful. It's also not too far removed. Spargo, Pablo. Sounds similar, doesn't no, it? No, it doesn't. Pablo. Not one part of that sounds similar at all. Pablo I'm and with Spargo. Him. It's kind of close. Now, next now. now the stables are full. It's cows and. and We've got a goat there. Who's sexy? I'm going to have to be next. Not prove you can cope with these. What do you mean? Prove I can cope <laughs> with these. I've been doing free. I'm, I'm responsibility up. Me. Can we just get on camera what you just said, please? Could you so come? Watching this. Yep. It's so much better. Four no, horses and a baby? Yeah. So wh whose bank did this one come out of? Yours, and I'm going to sleep easy tonight. Thank you. Hear that, everyone? Yeah. Bola! <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Meeting the family. Already Lorenzo's been a little sh chased him and then almost got kicked in the head. What does Faith do for work? Here we bro? go, a bit of action. Shorty is killing it's shit. Going out well. Here. All my makeup's like melted off in the I know my she face. used to do modeling like oh, crazy, go, right? Hey yo, oh, big God. bells with the oh, mother. Yeah. <laughs> right, Gift it to the family. Come on, gang. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you, thank you for the love, man. That really means a lot to me. Thank you, thank you so much. Already helping us with our sub goal. We going into Sunday chilling. Thank you, thank you, gang. You're the fucking goat for that. <laughs> They're gonna meet officially for the first time. Definitely gotta fix pen. it. Oh, Definitely he's gotta fix risky. it. Thanks, I'm not gonna lie, just in case. Like, I don't want my Shetlands to get hurt. <laughs> Poor Tommy. Poor Tommy. Oh yeah, here goes Kelly chasing him. Shock. Imagine my shock. I ain't fight. I'm just gonna narrate because you can't really see. They're all fing running. Going crazy. Oh Lorenzo, get out of Bells, you be buying body. horses and shit. Baby. I'm so scared in case he gets hurt. Leave my Lorenzo alone. Eh? Callie just <laughs> winds him right up. Just don't let him near the Shetlands. Callie's our like, unboss and I need to let you know that I'm boss. She ain't letting no one near her Shetlands. Oh Shetlands like her babies. Genuinely, you'd have thought she birthed a Shetland. She is that protective. She's blowing. Lorenzo, be careful. How long does it take for horses to, to like become friends? She's trying to chill. Other. He's just trying to eat. And Kelly's like, yeah, let's go, mate. She won't let the Shetlands near him. Yeah, he's chill. Look, guys, stop what you're doing. Even though what you're doing is watching me, so don't stop watching me, but watch me uh, here <laughs> instead of this. Anyway, okay, guys, I have. Some important news for you. If you are sick oh, and right. tired of carrying heavy bags out of your car every time you want to do the food shop just to cook meals that are going to take you absolutely ages, I have something for you. Oh, she fire. <laughs> Hello, Fresh. You've kindly given me an offer of 60% off your first box. That's probably hella good for moms, too, especially if you don't like, like you say, you don't want to go to the so shop, if you, you don't want to be student, caring stuff. A full time worker, She's killing it. Or a busy mum, and you're just trying to find a way to make sure you get all of your nutrition in. This space, you like, spend hours 10 videos, and she already gave that. Hello, Fresh. Also, allow you to be creative with it. the meals that you cook and things that you possibly wouldn't pick up from the store yourself to cook at home. Another great thing that I love about Hello Fresh is that you can choose what kind of recipes that you like. Mostly meat, veggie, family, quick cook, calorie smart, or pescatarian. Straight to my front door, no messing around, no. A lot of people don't be understanding that shit either, bro, because after a while, like, yeah, like, 
her dating Bez got her the first look. Like, people started to look at her, you know what I'm saying? Maybe a little bit more than what they already were. But to be able to keep everybody around, it's all on her. No Tesco's trips, no trying to find a car parking space. It's right here. Just walking down to check on the horses now. It is 8.52, borderline 9 p.m. Now yeah, I'm just gonna go check them. And I can see like in my neighbor's, well, neighbor's, neighbor's, neighbor's garden, like kids bouncing around in like swimming pool and pool floats. And it just brings back mems from like being 15. And I think it's so cute. When am I realistically ever just gonna jump in a pool and have fun again? Like, I don't like getting my hair wet now. But anywho, gonna go check my horses. I'm a grown up, I got responsibilities now. Oh, slay, I think. Maybe not, I don't know. Uh, the lighting, I thought it did sink, but maybe it didn't. Rabbit! <laughs> They're so cute, like old dogs are going. <gasps> hey guys, have we all been friends? <gasps> I love it. Look at all my ponies. Yeah, I've not really got much to say. I'm not being funny like this. We've all you? seen a fair few vlogs from me about buying another horse, realistically. Is this old news or new news? What is new news is that I need my teeth whitened, but we won't go there. Hello, gonna focus for me? Really a dumbass. Hey boy. Okay, let her talk See, the too prettiest much. part about him is on the other side, which is his mane. Look at that mane. Stunning, stunning. My mum did those plaits. And then obviously Callie has sectioned off her Shetlands and possibly won't let them near him so we're, we're on a renaming the horses situation Callie is staying as Callie she's too far gone Callie is Callie Lorenzo is Lorenzo because he's Lorenzo um I didn't like the name when I got him though to be fair but it's stuck so that's what he is let me put you on here somewhere stable <laughs> do you get it somewhere stable <laughs> easy ass mm, yeah. but no anyway, I, I, I was don't gonna know. call Dora well I keep calling her Bella she's not Bella but I'm like oh has Bella done this who's that? like who's Bella she's Dora so I might just have to change her name to Dora oh my god Bella I might have to <laughs> I might have to change her name to Bella. But to be honest with you, I'm just going to call her Feral Beryl because that's what she is. She only lets Tommy touch her. He's my loan. Tommy helps me out. He's great. I don't know, Feral Beryl slash Bella slash Dora. And the new one, he's so beautiful. He's stunning. He's a Palomino. Like, he is the business. And someone looked at him and went, Spargo. Sorry, what? What? That's offensive. How does that Smart. even pop, in, like, pop into someone's head? I've never even heard that before. It is a bit funny though, because you know West Ham, whatever, they've just that won their like, league or something. I don't know, they won in Prague, so whatever that does for them. We've got a little bit of a Spanish thing going on. We've got a Lorenzo, a Dora. This is an so we decided name, to keep bro. like the Spanish thing going. So Ethan wants to call him Pablo, and I wanted Santi or Cruz. I actually think Cruz suits him the most, but Ethan said Pablo, and I'm not against it. And the only reason why I'm like leaning towards calling in him is because his owners sent a football because apparently he likes a football and i don't mean a treat ball for all these equestrians watching i mean an actual football in with his stuff i'll try and find it when i go up and that is the only reason why i'm like oh it's actually quite funny he's calling pablo now but yeah i know you Should shouldn't Vic, rename right? horses because it's unlucky but it's either Vic or Bez. what's the what what's the worst it's gonna do you're gonna you're gonna my hairline is that what you got in store from me? None of my animals respond to their name anyway, so I may as well call them what I want. Oh my god, he got his chopper out Is earlier. Please no. Like his dong. And it's huge. I thought he was gonna bloody mount my Shetland. And I thought, Jesus hey, Christ, yo. gonna bloody break her back. Anywho, don't know if that's appropriate for YouTube, but yeah, yeah, there you go. It's also kind of like a sad video because this will be like my last buy-in video because my stables, I have four stables, <laughs> hey dogs, and now four stables are taken up. I could always put the shetties in together, but I don't think they like it, hence why they're in their own ones. But that remains the goat pen. Ooh. We have a goat pen. Interesting. I'm gonna show you the football as well. By the way, I'm wearing clothes. It's just a dress. Yes, yeah, so this is what you come with. Sorry. Goats are so loud oh, and annoying. Rolo's actually got tech with the football. Rolo, Rolo, I'd almost Rolo. be okay if okay, she just cool. built more Rolo. stables right there. Let me, let me show him the ball, man. Rolo, stay. I'm over well, here talking like I got an actual input then, on this. But you got in my way, so I'll just have to show you like 20 kick ups another time because the dog ruined it. So, by the yeah, looks okay. of it, Rolo wants to be called David Beckham. Ready? Look, Rolo. Beckham. Bend it. Bend it. Oh, I've just got schooled up by a dog. Right, Ethan. What? You know you want to call the horse Pablo? 
Yeah, because it's Spanish. No, because after Pablo for now. Yeah, so it's called we Pablo. We can call him Pablo for now. Oh. It's really good. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually, it's not bad. It's, it's Pablo for now. <laughs> but it is Pablo. For now. <coughs> nice. Morning guys, jump scare from Jesus the last day because you know, just woke up. I'm making the horses breakfast. So I thought I'd take you with me. It's really actually not that exciting because they literally just have soaked pony nuts at the minute because Callie gets a bit colicky um, and they're out on new grass. So they actually really don't need that much food. It's just something so they can have their nuts. vitamins and whatnot with. This was like vet recommended for Callie. So Callie has one scoop of pony nuts in her bowl and then I soak it and apparently the water just really helps with their stomach. Yeah. That is for the shitlands. Gonna put in some garlic next. I literally don't really measure this, I just, it just helps with the flies apparently. Um, bad breath and all that. I don't know how true that is, might be an old wives tale, but we put it in anyway, so that's that. Then they have okay. some chamomile flowers. Again, it's just good for like anxieties or whatever, so it calms them. Not that I think any of them are overly stressed, but listen, I love a chamomile tea every now and then, so why not? Brewer's yeast. It comes oh. with um, Pablo. Oh, I'm just yes, gonna give this baby. to Pablo because he's used oh. to it. Oh. And then we got Fly free, the natural fly repeller. That goes in there. Linseed, we love that. It's crazy because um, I didn't, I didn't so know they. Like I would think you would brush in fly repeller. And I didn't think you would like feed them just fly Just little repellent. drizzles for the Shetlands. There we go. Let's put some water. Let's let all this soak. Let's go get the ponies. We are at the field. And he is the only one looking. Oh no, Lorenzo's coming, bless his soul. Um, this is how I call my horses in. I've got a little, little deer bell. Oh, cool. No, uh, it does slap, it does slap. That's it. Can't do anything with my poop. left hand. <laughs> Oops. Callie! Oh, she is a bloody nightmare. I think you and Lorenzo are first, actually. Like, Callie is actually so controlling. Hey, Lorenzo. Right, they are all in. Pablo could look a bit happier about it. There you go. <laughs> Kelly, who has been causing absolute havoc, by the way. Kicking the door down, calling them. She's actually a wind up. She's by far the worst mannered, I think, out of all of them. Um, then we've got Lorenzo, just chilling. And then Dora, who has to have a high door. Yeah. There she is. Uh, <laughs> here we go, your nose. She has to have a high door because she jumps out. So all the She's a jumper. Are in. That's it. The horses for this morning are pretty much done. Ethan wants a shower, so I'm gonna go back up to the house, let him have a shower while they're all having their breakfast, let their food go down and come back later and then maybe do some work with them. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Let them settle, let them have a rest, let them have their breakfast, and then we'll come back later. He's excited to go horse shopping. I'm coming for ham and chips. You think I'm on lunch? Oh, you have to. What? Oh, you, you have to. Shopping spree. No. Oh. Oh, all over the back is it. And now we are in the cafe playing with toys. And um, Daddy just spilled coffee everywhere. I tried a coffee that's just come out of the coffee machine at 100 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> I said try it for me and it has literally just been made and burnt all of its mouth. Um, I always put my finger in it first. Every time. Dada. While we're here, we may as well do a new car reveal because let's be honest. I love it, but I hate it. I hate when kids I hate when parents bring kids to restaurants. I hate when I'm out and I just hear kids just being kids. <laughs> Especially when I'm like getting food, I'm like, oh god, oh god. Wait till they can be quiet, god damn it. <laughs> so I'm not gonna make the video whilst it's clean. Wow. Oh, blur the number plate, Mr. Editor. Okay. Wow. Who works? That's tall enough. Just because you can put it on the counter and survive, mine needs boxes. She needed it because that Land Rover was about to croak. Probably about to start. Come here. Don't back to back with me right now. Can't stretch out properly. Yeah. Perfectly matched, wow. Perfectly matched. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm, I'm taller. We're all the same height laying down, I think. Anyway, from the hall, 
I've got a brown num num, and Christ. it is Lemu, Lemu, because I just think Pablo will look good in brown. I've got this. It is a lunge cabison. Is that so like a saddle? So training. It kind of goes on like a little bit of a bridle. Yeah, and while we wait for a Cyber Sunday, that's what I'll be doing. Lunge line onto here, and have it go this way, this way, or you can connect it to an actual bit that goes around the tummy. But I don't do that. I just put this saddle on it and. Put lunch line on. I then got him a new girth because his belly is rather large and his girth that he's got now is rather small. I bought a hair collar for the field, which is a baby blue color, which I think- Jesus Christ, what? Oh my God. There's so much that goes into owning a horse, dude. Is actually cute and it doesn't really matter if he ruins it, to be honest with you. That whole like well, Tiffany blue? Okay. It does, Pablo, it does, but. It's not the most expensive thing in the world, so... But I bought a head collar that oh, I love. I love this one. Um, I actually wish I saw it when I was buying all of Callie's stuff. It's this, and I just thought it was really, like, fancy because it's, like, all rope. I don't know, okay. I just thought it would look nice. It's rope around the back as well. It would just look the business, you know? You know? Just a lunge line, but I like the ones with handles because I can also walk the dogs. A lunge line? I meant a lead rope. This is a lead rope. But yeah, with the handles, then I can actually walk the dogs with them as well. This is going to match the rope head collar. That's cute. A new brow band. I did actually want more of a yellow one. But they didn't have it. Anyway, that's my haul. A bit rude that it cost me £220, but it did, so that's fun. That's a lot for only $200, though. That's a lot. Anyway, I'm gonna go lunge my horse. Walking to the stables. Such a long journey. Really getting my steps in. That is sarcasm. Like, I would've thought each of those items was like $115, $120. Like, especially the like neck things, like, or the head brace things or whatever. Oh yeah. There's Lorenzo. Apparently everyone else is asleep. I generally think they are asleep or they've broken out. Hi Pablo. Oh look at his lip. This means they're relaxed, which is really cute. Let me see your lip, Baba. You see how it's like open? <laughs> and Cully. Yeah, she's asleep. Hey girl. Hey girl. Hey what Lorenzo. Are we Laying down right next to the shit is crazy. That is, that is, that is crazy. Callie, wild. You've had a sleep as well, look. <laughs> I need whatever they're getting. Oh, you've been asleep as well. <laughs> Look at all the straw. Oh, you just wake up, girl. Yeah. Look at you. I'm going to check on Callie. They, they all ate hey. and just crashed out. Is that a tired noise? Oh. Okay. I'm gonna stop this vlog here until I know what's going on a bit. So Kelly is still lying down. Um, I haven't really got an answer with her that yet. sounds sad um, as hell. But I can't just call her because she's making noises lying down because she can actually just be sleeping. Um, she's passing a lot of gas while she's lying down, so I don't think it's colic because she's not like frantically rolling, moving, or looking at her belly. She's just like dozing and nodding off so i'm hoping she's just asleep so i'm gonna go do stuff with pablo in the menage and then hopefully by the time i get back she's up and then if she's not i'll kind of monitor it on that because i'm hoping if i bring him out the stable she'll want to get up and have a look at that anyway so we'll see and what did i say look who's up because look who's oh. out <laughs> i knew she'd do that she's Jelly. too nosy well he was really really good to lunch oh, i mean wow. lazy of course look at However, the fit though good. So we're gonna take that as a positive. Look and at the sweating. fit though. But yeah. you've not sweat for a while, eh boy? But you've not been in proper work for a while, look. That belly. Get you clipped, I think. Right guys, that is gonna conclude the vlog because this is the new horse. And yeah, I'm like pretty happy with him. Needs re-breaking in, not really sure he's broken properly to ride. But yeah, like and subscribe What's guys. That? And if you want more videos with the horses, just let me know in the comments. Bye! Uh please, what the fuck?